going to show you how to pin for the inside seam. You are going to have your shorts where the first seam that you sewed was a curve, that was a J shape. And then the second one that you sewed was down the sides, it was just a straight line. Now you're going to be sewing the inside seam. So you're going to find the J shape that you sewed and you're going to go all the way to the bottom of it. Okay. You're going to find the same J shape on the other side of your shorts and you're going to match up the bottom of those two J's and this is going to be the first place that you put your pin. So you should be able to see the seams because we're still working so that your shorts look like they're inside out or that the right sides are together. And the first place you're going to put a pin is right where these two seams come together. So it almost makes a little X right here. Okay, so then I'm going to take my pin and I'm going to put it down and then back up again right where those two come together. Okay, then I'm going to start from my center pin and I'm going to pin down the inside of the leg here. Okay, do not worry if the bottoms don't match up. If those are slightly off, that will get fixed later. Just leave it like this for now. Okay, so now I'm going to take another pin and about halfway down the leg, I'm going to put my pin down and back up again. And then down at the bottom, I'll do the same thing. Put my pin down and back up again. All right, then from the center, from where I started, I'm going to put pins going down the other direction. So I'll take my pin here, about halfway down the leg, I'm going to put a pin. Now make sure, just like on your side seams, that the two pieces of fabric are right next to each other. Okay? Do not pin it so that there would be a big space like this in between. You have to make it so that the fabric is next to each other by moving it with your fingers before putting the pin in. And then the pin is what makes it so that the fabric stays right next to each other. Okay, then I'll put one more down at the bottom. Again, do not be concerned if these don't match up. I'll put my pin down and back up again. Okay. So I should have a total of five pins for this step. If your shorts look like this and they're printed on, make sure that they still look like they're inside out and you can still see the seams just like on the black one that I just showed you. Okay but you will match up the bottom of the J's the same way on this one so that you start off with having the little X at the bottom and then your pin would go here, down and back up and you'd stretch out the sides down each of the legs to put your pins. Make sure your shorts still look like they're inside out when you do this step.